Hello, and welcome to Day of PVM number two. Going to be starting off the day with a Jadinko task, and uh, we'll see where it goes from there. I now have Invention unlocked, and uh, yeah, I need to get a lot of supplies for that, and I plan on doing a bit of bossing at some point today. And completing that task makes 120 tasks in a row for another 100 Slayer points. Uh, up to 428, getting close to the, uh, uh, what is it, the thing with um, gargoyles where you can kill them faster. Yeah. And here's a hard clue that I got from the Janinko task. And nothing good. So, got a few Slayer VIP tickets from the uh, Clue Scroll weekend. Not many, but um, got the choice of Grot Worms or Water Fiends. Gonna pick, uh, eh, I think Grot Worms, just because um, they've got better alkables. Worth a little bit more money, and I can save the ticket. And here's the first hard clue from the Grot Worms. Uh, some decent alkables, you know, and it's always nice getting the uh, Natures and Astrals. Um, I burned through those really quickly doing my farm runs. And here's a hard clue. That was the uh, first Grot Worm kill going back to the um, the task. Uh, I don't have an Ancient Cloak yet, but they're not that uncommon, so I'm just going to re-roll. Uh, got another Quartz Summons, and a... oh, Rune uh, Trimmed. That looks nice. Okay, cool. And here's the next hard clue casket. It's got, like, nothing. Here's the next clue casket. Uh, puzzle skipping ticket. So, bank value goes up a little bit, but the rest is just kinda crap. So, the next Slayer task is going to be, uh, Shadow Creatures. First kill, I got a, a golden beam, and it's a Trisk Fragment 2. Uh, I think that means I have the first fragment in my bank. But that just, that's kind of surprising. I've never killed these mobs before, uh, ever. <laughs> and first one gives me a Trisk. So, getting a new Slayer task. Um, I'm going to use the VIP ticket because I want to do some Ascension Creatures. Well, sadly, all I got was a single Keystone. Uh, that makes, like, five tasks? No, four tasks for only uh, five keys. So, not too great. Uh, Adamant Dragons. Uh, don't think I can do that. Uh, but I need to go get my VIP ticket. So I'm gonna pick my um, Abbey Demons task here, but uh, seeing as I'm gonna be getting a lot of gold from that, I need to unlock this. How to craft Rings of Slaying. Awesome. So, about to finish up a Soul Reaper task of Zilliana. Got uh, 12 kills to do. Got my first piece of uh, Ceridoman War Priest, and I'm going to disassemble it for, uh, let's see, a powerful component like that, Ceridoman component. Cool. And like five mobs later, I got some Sarah War Priest uh, gauntlets. Nice, my first drop from Ceridoman. I'm, uh,. I don't know, that's 20 kill count now, and I don't know how many extra horses or whatever I ended up killing in all that time. Um, it's nice to have the ranged one though, that's pretty good. And there's the end of my first reaper task for the day. Oh man, I've got to make it back to death. I've got a uh, another reaper assignment, and it's about to be the reset time. Uh, yeah, uh, but that's 15 reaper points for that, that one right there, which puts me at... Uh, just over a hundred, I think. And 28 from Criara. That's not something I'm really looking forward to doing, but, um, you know, I just got a better ranged amulet. And uh, aside from that, uh, well, I only have one piece of Armadil equipment so far. Uh, at least, like, one piece of um, Armadil ranged equipment, you know, the tier 70 stuff. Um, so yeah, I, ca I can do that. Maybe I'll get an AVNC task to go alongside it. Kind of hoped that that was uh, Dragon Bones, but got 69 Big Bones, rare drop table. Alright. And here's another hard clue. 
And nothing good, so I'm just going to re-roll it. Oh, wow. Wow! Three of the same page? Those are my first pages on my account, and they're all three exactly the same. What? <laughs> you can see here, my, my clue scroll tab, like, here, page. Nothing. Three of them that are exactly the same. <laughs> Uh, all right, time for a new task from Morvran. Hopefully, something good. Uh, I'm gonna pick the Grot Worms because I can't do Rune Dragons. Eventually, I'll want to do the Rune Dragons though, so I'm not gonna waste the points on blocking them. And I finished a Crystal Key doing that Abbey Demons task. So let's see. Hopefully, something good. Eh, yeah, three Rune Bars. That's that's pretty good. And here's another hard clue to end off that Grot Worms task. Got four not skipping tickets, which, uh, yeah, just more stuff to make the bank uh, look valuable. And just because uh, it's opportune, I'm going to pick the Vire Watch. Um, and going to end off the day of PVM. Well, I'll go do some Criara right now because that is my new uh, Reaper task. And I really want to get this uh, this hand cannon. Uh, the rest of the way to level 10. It's got um, 10,000 left, and then I'll be my first item to all the way to level 10. Uh, and then I'll skyrocket my invention level. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to go do some of that. Well, I just freaked out seeing a golden beam, um, but it's just Armadil Warpriest. Uh, I'm going to disassemble it because uh, the Armadil components are apparently really good. Well, that first trip was a 6-kill trip, which is... Uh, one more than my previous record at uh, Criara. I, I swear, like, they hit annoyingly hard uh, compared to the rest of the God Wars dungeon bosses. So, yeah, it's gonna be a few trips to get the uh, 28 Reaper task done. And there's my second God Sword Shard 1 for the account. That's uh, alright. More happy to see the food drop here, honestly. And with the first kill of the third trip, uh, my hand cannon just hit level 10. So my first uh, augmented item to hit level 10. Um, gonna disassemble it just as soon as this trip ends. And here's the next hard clue scroll for the day. And that's pretty crap. Gonna go get my free hard clue scroll from uh, Jilly Wildekers if I can find them again. And I was wrong about being able to claim a clue from Jilly Willikers. He's still standing around here from the winter weekend, but, uh, uh, the weekend's over. It ended, like, uh, 18 hours ago or something like that. It's still Monday for me, but it's not Monday for the game. Um, yeah, so that's the end of, uh, today's day of PVM. I know not much really happened. It was just a little bit of Slayer and some clues. Um... But there was a lot of delays uh, brought about because I don't want to do Armadil if this is on cooldown. Like, I want to have that up. It extends my uh, my trips by one or two kills. And I've got, like, two trips left. Um, like, 12 kills left to go. Uh, I got kind of unlucky there. Seeing as I only have uh, one Godsword Shard drop and the Glove drop at 39kc. Uh, yeah. Pretty bad. Um... And, uh, well, the the Vire Watch that came up here, it makes me want to do uh, questing tomorrow so I can actually get my Sun Spear. Because uh, it's only a few hours of uh, skilling until I can do the quests. Then, like, two hours of questing, and I have my Sun Spear to do Vire Watch a lot easier. And uh, so I can get good prayer XP from them. Um, so, yeah, that's the end of the second day of PVM. Hope you enjoyed. I'll try to make a new episode sooner than like a, uh, a week and a half delay between them, or it's even up to two weeks now, I guess. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. See you in the next video.